Even in the film Final Destination, you would have not seen such a heartbreaking disaster. While everyone was enjoying the end of the year, someone's life ended at Montgomery Regional Airport. Hey guys, welcome back to Top Travel where we discuss the entire length of America from a traveler's perspective. In today's video, we'll show you Alabama Airport, a worker was sucked into a jet engine. So without wasting any time, let's get started. According to a media story quoting officials, a worker perished in a bizarre accident at a rural airport in Alabama, the United States, after being ingested into the engine of a parked American Airlines jetliner. The accident happened at 3 p.m. on Saturday at the Montgomery Regional Airport in the state according to the American tabloid New York Post. The National Transportation Safety Board claimed in a statement to media outlet Insider on Sunday that the worker was sucked into an Embraer 170 engine that was parked near the gate when he was killed. Although the worker has not been identified, it is known that he formerly worked for Piedmont's Airlines, an American Airlines Group subsidiary. The flight that caused the tragedy is said to have originated in Dallas and was operated by Envoy Air, another part of the American Airlines Group. The NTSB and the FAA are conducting a joint investigation into the incident. According to the NTSB, a preliminary report is likely within the next two to three weeks. The official statement from Montgomery Regional Airport. The Montgomery Regional Airport has reported an industrial accident that occurred around 3 p.m. on Saturday, December 31st. A member of the American Airlines and Piedmont Airlines ground staff was killed. Wade Davis, executive director of the Alabama airport said, we are deeply grieved to learn of the fortunate loss of a AA Piedmont Airlines staff member. Our thoughts and prayers are with the family during this terrible time. American Airlines also issued an official statement expressing its sadness over the events. It went on to say that its priority was to provide all possible assistance to everyone affected at this difficult time. Following the disaster, all outgoing and incoming planes via the Montgomery Airport were temporarily grounded. Later, Montgomery Regional Airport stated on Twitter that regular operations resumed at 8.30 p.m. local time. While while injury or death from jet engine ingestion is uncommon, it isn't unprecedented. In a business magazine in 2008, Boeing underlined the hazards of ingestion, stating that in nearly 40 years of running Boeing 737 Model 100 and 200 planes, there had been 33 cases of ingestions, which of which resulted in death. During the same time span, four deadly ingestion accidents happened on 737 models 300, 400, 500, and next generation planes, according to Boeing. According to the aircraft manufacturer, the possibility possibility of hazard exists on all airplane models. We won't urge you to like, share on this video, just comment rip if you feel like, and subscribe to our channel if you want to learn more about traveling throughout America. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.